fucking jerk off. Oh. John? Did you see the last episode? Yeah. yeah. It was the yeah. Oh, oh, drugs. Season premiere. Season 2. Damn. How about those people? Oh. AJ Faseco. Uh, Jose Canseco? Nah. I just farted and shit almost came out. Josie Consuelo is the guy on the quick road spots. Who? No, that's my dad. <laughs> Josie Consuelo is your dad? <laughs> John. <clears throat> How about four car traditional now? So who goes first? No talking. No talking. No talking. No talking. Tom? What are you doing here, man? I sell violins now. I sell violins? What do you mean? You want some breakfast or something, dude? Yeah, that would be great. Get you out of here, Max. <laughs> I want Mike fall asleep in my basement with my dad. I had anal, I had anal <laughs> sex last night for the first time. With yourself? Or? No, no, I, I stuck it in. It's it good. It's, you know. Yeah? Yeah. So you were the pitcher you're saying? Yeah, yeah, yeah. You were the uh, Burt Bly Levin? The who? The Burt Bly Levin? I was the one who packed the fudge. The uh, uh, <laughs> Brett Saberhagen? Oh, God, yeah. <laughs> Did he like it? Yeah. No. Brett no, Saberhagen no, it was a girl. Or... Shout right. out. You guys better hurry up because Mr. 3000 is starting in like 15 minutes. Best fucking movie ever. You ever see it? Of course. I, uh, true story, two weeks ago I had two midterms and I stayed home, watched Mr. 3000 the whole time, failed both midterms. No touching your cards during a point of order. So, um, so we put a man on Jupiter. You put a man on Jupiter. I didn't say that. You said we, but I, I, I certainly didn't. Well, I didn't do that. You said we put a man on Jupiter. Yeah, the royal we, the editorial. Anyway, he... You gotta let me, let me know what happened, man. Like, did... Did Maggie leave you or something? No, no, she died. Why did she die? Mm. Um, well, we were on our way to Prussia, and she got caught in an escalator, and she died. Prussia? Yeah, that's right. John, Prussia hasn't been a country since 1947. And n nobody dies in escalators, if, if anybody. It's only the, like little babies, and nobody gives a shit about fucking babies. Prussia is the country between Russia and Canada. John, that's Alaska, and it's part of the United States. Oh, Tom, the years have not treated you well. You've gone totally mental. John, I just saw you trying to sell me a violin on the boardwalk. Something had to have happened to you. And uh, you gotta let me know so we can find a way to steer your ship in the right direction. It's like I told you, we were on our way to Persia. Oh, it's Persia now. Yeah, we were on our way to Persia, and that's when I got the email on my Chuck Berry from my boss at the Daily Bugle. Let me guess, his name is J. Jonah Jameson. No, Perry White? Of course it's Perry White. Anyway, the email said that I was losing my job because I spent the company's entire surplus on a vacation to the Byzantine Empire. And, um, you know, after I got fired and... After Maggie died, I figured, let me just sell some violins on the boardwalk. How is the uh, violin business going these days? Not so good. All I've sold is two packs of gum. Two packs of Orbit gum, huh? Yeah, yeah. All right. How, how did you even wind up back in your hometown? Oh. So I ran to this guy, Gus Polanski, and his polka band, the Kenosha Kickers. They were on their way to Milwaukee from Scranton, and they gave me a lift. Alright, never mind. Have you... Do you still talk to, like, Mike and AJ and them? No, not since the last time I talked to you. Since the, uh, debacle. Yeah, let's not... Uh, let's not go there. It's been a nice eight years. Mm, I don't think anybody cares anymore, anyway. Yeah, the, like, the last real memory I have of them is when we played Mal all the time. Wow, Tom. Even somebody like you, who's clearly lost everything, including their mind, still remembers those Mal games. Yeah, we were quite a few characters, weren't we? Ah, uh, we were. Let's see, we had me, 
you, Dirty Frankie. He always had those dirty oh, tactics. Oh, 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 dirty Frankie tactics, if you will. Not really cheating. Closest thing to it. Propaganda, I guess you can call it. But for some reason, it was always being done towards Seth. What are you guys doing over here? So through the channel room. Hard slash Done. card. Done. Last card. Mal. Oh! oh man. <laughs> yes. Fucking dildo basket. That's a shame, bud. Yeah. Dirty Frankie at his best. Get out, Seth. Good. I'll see you later. No, seriously. Seth, Seth, Seth you really gotta leave. Dude. You gotta go. The AG was always a quiet player. He never really made many mistakes, but if he did, it always made no sense and got a laugh out of all of us. Six of clubs. <laughs> the AJ always did make us laugh. It's a, it's a shame what happened to him. What happened to him? Well, he started getting into uh, heavy drugs, and he became a pilot for uh, TWA. And uh, he started to smoke a sock one day, and he jumped right out of the plane. Thought he could fly me a superhero. Shit. Man, the, the funny thing is, he didn't actually die from the fall. But where he landed, he landed in the middle of a wildebeest stampede. And he died right in front of his son Simba. At least he died doing what he loved. I guess so, you know, Sausage was a great player also, but he knew the game so well that he just didn't care enough, but whenever he made a mistake, he let the whole fucking world know he made that mistake. Out of turn. Out of damn it! <laughs> Jerry never really got the rules down. We always thought he'd get them eventually, but time after time we were proven wrong. No touching your cards. Failure to say Mal. Failure to say last card. Failure to say salute to the chairman. I don't get it. No talking. Oh. Failure to say have a nice day. Failure to say have a nice day. Have a nice day. Failure to pick up two cards. No touching your cards during a point of order. What the fuck? Fuck you, Jesus. <sighs> yep. When I was chairman, I felt like I was on top of the world. Well, you never let anybody else be the chairman. If I can just go back to those days. Who says you can't? What do you mean? Get me a phone book. I'll get it.